Hello colleagues, how are you? Nefertiti Pointer here with the Devereaux Center for Resilient Children. I hope I've caught you in the middle of enjoying a pretty good day. Let's keep going and learning, practicing skills to promote our resilience, well-being, and self-stewardship, which is one of my favorite words. Self-stewardship being how we care for ourselves, self-stewardship. So today I'm talking to myself again as I'm talking to you as we talk about strategies. And this time around, our strategy is make some time for quiet. And I could say find some time for quiet, but I'm going to choose my words carefully and I'm going to encourage you to make some time for quiet. There is so much going on. There is always someone talking, someone requesting something of you, something asking of, of some, someone asking of you. Uh, there's music, there is TV, there's radio, there's podcasts, there's videos, there's webinars, and there's videos. And it's just hard sometimes to put a pause on life. And I'm just asking you to put a pause button on every now and again and find some time for quiet. And in those moments of quiet, just become closer to you. Just just be able to be still and be you and be reflective. You can use that quiet time to meditate. You can use that quiet time to pray. I encourage you to look around your house or home or workspace and look for light or shadows. Light or shadows are always easy to find. So just focus on those for a few minutes. But give yourself permission to put a pause on life and to get quiet. This is a great strategy to share with others, children as well. Our strategy for this time around until we can see each other again is find time for quiet. And you know what? Let's say it this way because this is really how it might happen. Make time for some quiet time. Okay, Nefertiti Pointer here with the Devro Center for Resilient Children. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Take good care and be safe. Talk to you later.